A stable process is the prerequisite for consistent quality of the molded parts. The IQ Process Observer was developed to make the stability of the process visible. The IQ Process Observer constantly monitors all important measured values and set values of the machine and automatically recognizes when the process is unstable. It helps the user to identify and rectify problems more quickly or to avoid them in the first place. This can save a lot of time and trouble. Unlike conventional process analysis systems, the IQ Process Observer does not need any effort from the user. The software is based on the know-how of injection molders. Therefore, for example, no parameters need to be selected and no limits need to be set. It all happens automatically. The software offers three types of analysis. The process change analysis detects whether measured values remain essentially the same or rise or fall significantly. This allows you to see when the process has settled again after changing a setting. In the second type of analysis, the reference deviation, the user triggers the automatic tolerance determination with just a single click. The IQ process observer then checks whether measured values remain within their tolerances. For both types of analysis, many values are observed. The values are arranged in groups. This enables the user to keep an overview. The process steps, plasticize, inject, cooling, demolding, and production form the top level groups. The third type of analysis, called process nodes, shows anomalies as text messages. By clicking, you get clear suggestions for improvement. IQ Process Observer can be found on the machine, under production, Here. It can also be found in the components under Office. The indicators on the left hand side show which process steps were affected by changes in the last shot. The green one stands for a stable process, and the yellow one for a process change. For further details, either click on an indicator or on the View All button. Right now, the last 20 shots are displayed. The number of shots can be changed here. Special events in this period are indicated with a symbol. It can be switching to semi automatic or fully automatic mode, or reading parts data. Here you can see the parameter groups. Yellow areas in the bar indicate that at least one parameter in the group has changed. This view only shows groups with yellow areas in the bar. If you want to see stable parameters as well, just click on Display All Analyses. Open the group to see the associated parameters. If you do not want to analyze a parameter, you can deactivate it. Deactivation only applies to the current type of analysis. To reactivate a parameter, either use the Display All Analyses view or select the analysis type in the settings menu. Deactivated parameters are displayed on the left, activated parameters on the right. The parameters can be activated or deactivated using the arrow buttons.
In addition to actual values, the IQ Process Observer also analyzes set values. Set values have a white bar and do not affect the color of group bars and indicator on the landing page. Changes to set values are indicated by the pencil icon. If you need to change set values, you can switch from the IQ Process Observer to the respective screen pages with a single click. The arrow button takes you back. Set values and the corresponding actual values are displayed together. Temperatures are an example of this. In this case, the user has changed temperature set values. Beside the temperatures, many other parameters, like the melt cushion and viscosity, change until the process has finally settled down again. The process has reached a new, stable state. But if you want to know when a process returns to a defined state, for instance, after deviations due to production stops, you use the reference deviation. Process changes and process notes work fully automatically. For the reference deviation, however, the user needs to define a reference. This can be done here. When defining the reference, the part quality should have been OK for the last 50 shots. Now you can see the indicators on the right-hand side. And you can switch to the detail view of the reference deviation. The navigation is the same as for the process change. In addition, this view has the following properties. It shows when the reference was created. The reference, and for actual values, the upper and lower threshold values are displayed in the diagrams. The reference and the threshold values were determined automatically. If required, they can be adjusted for each parameter. For example, the reference for actual value. The adjusted settings are effective from the next shot. The reference is automatically saved with the parts data. It is used again when the parts data is read. This allows you to compare today's production with that of a year ago. Independent of the analyses of the process change and the reference deviation, the IQ Process Observer recognizes possibilities for optimization. These are displayed on the landing page. Further information can be obtained by clicking. You can set an alarm so that you are informed of current process notes in good time. By settings, in the process notes, This is also possible for the two other types of analysis, process change and reference deviation. The IQ Process Observer runs on the Edge device. This is a computer that is connected to the injection molding machine and to the internet. If the connection is interrupted, you will be taken to the connection page. Further information on the connection can be found right here.
You can obtain further information on the IQ programs in our customer training courses. Please find the details on our Engel website under training or contact us at training.austria at engel.at. We also offer application engineering support at your site if you need it.